that has many talking all across the country, legalizing marijuana. And a state representative from Madison wants Wisconsin to be the next state to regulate the substance. NBC 15's Zach Nugent breaks down her plan. Yeah, Lee, today Representative Melissa Sargent introduced a 90-page bill. It looks to decriminalize cannabis and legalize both medicinal and recreational use. It's time for Wisconsin marijuana solution. And Representative Sargent believes that solution is to bring marijuana out of the black market and into the legal market. I'm confident that the most dangerous thing about marijuana in Wisconsin is that it's illegal. The Democrats' bill would allow doctors to prescribe cannabis and allow for recreational sales taxed at 25%. It would set up a way for individuals to grow marijuana for personal use and would ban the sales of any edible marijuana-infused products. There are pieces that will be modeled after Colorado and Washington, other communities and states, and there are also parts of it that are very unique to the state of Wisconsin. Joe Irado, president of the Wisconsin Cannabis Project, describes himself as a conservative. He says this bill falls in line with Governor Walker's goals of creating jobs and lessening the tax burden on citizens. To me, this is a conservative issue. You know, um, the, what the free market has taught us is that uh, where goods and services are needed, they will go. So if there's a need for cannabis, it's going to go underground and, and drive up crime, and then you're just missing out on that economic opportunity. But, of course, not all are sold on the idea, and not all believe this bill will get any traction. We reached out to Assembly Speaker Robin Voss. His office issued the following statement. The bill does not have significant legislative support. The Speaker doesn't anticipate it getting to the floor. Some politicians have demonized the use of marijuana, but what is truly criminal is the money that Wisconsin is losing by not legalizing marijuana. And if you recall, Governor Walker last spring signed into a law a measure that permits the use of marijuana derivatives to treat certain medical disorders. But his spokeswoman says Walker opposes legalization and sees marijuana as a gateway drug.